A new game mode has just been announced for Battlefield 1, War Pigeons. The rumour was true, there will be a game mode in Battlefield 1 that uses pigeons. It sounds a little bit silly now, but let me explain to you how it works, what you have to do, and by the end of the video, I'm sure you'll be as excited as I am. So here's the description for War Pigeons taken from the Battlefield 1 website. During the Great War, man-made communication systems were still crude and unreliable, so dogs and pigeons were used extensively to carry messages. In the War Pigeons game mode, the opposing sides compete to use messenger pigeons to call in artillery barrages on the enemy. When the game starts, a pigeon coop with a messenger pigeon is placed somewhere on the map. Locate the pigeon before the enemy and carry it to a safe location out in the open. There you prepare a message and send it off, calling for artillery support. Once a message is successfully sent, an artillery barrage will strike the enemy. Now this sounds a little bit like obliteration in Battlefield 4. You and your team need to track down the location of the messenger pigeon, hold on to it, write a note, and then set it free. In obliteration, you needed to find the bomb, carry it to a bomb site, arm the bomb, and then after a timer completed, it would explode. Here in Battlefield 1, it doesn't sound like you'll need to do anything with explosives, but you will still have to write a message, which will of course take time. The extension beyond that is also the artillery barrage that comes in if you successfully manage to dispatch a pigeon. Whether this will work like the rush game mode where the enemies have to be spotted, or whether it's just a random barrage based on the map location remains to be seen. At this moment in time, we don't have a confirmed number of players allowed in this game mode. If it does follow obliteration from Battlefield 4, we did see a smaller squad obliteration make it into the CTE testing environment at one point, and we also had the large-scale obliteration as well, so it could come in many forms, but if we look at what DICE have done with Battlefield 1's rush game mode, limiting it to only 24 players, then we could be only seeing one variation of this game mode. Now you might still be laughing at this War Pigeon game mode, and I don't blame you, it is a little bit far-fetched, but if we look into a bit of World War I history, there's actually a very famous story of how a pigeon saved the lives of the Lost Battalion in the Battle of the Argonne Forest in 1918. The pigeon was called Sher Ami, and it was assigned to the USA during World War I, but it was originally donated by the pigeon fanciers of Great Britain. On October the 3rd, 1918, Major Charles Whittlesey and over 500 other American soldiers found themselves trapped in the forest of Argonne, behind enemy lines with no food or ammunition left. They'd also started to take friendly fire from allies who didn't know where they were, with artillery barrages raining in on them and from German fighters in the forest as well. 24 hours later, over 300 men had lost their lives and only 190 or so remained in the trenches. The last hope for the battalion was to try and use their messenger pigeons to relay a message back to their headquarters to get them to stop dropping artillery barrages. The first and second birds were both shot down before they left the forest. The third, Cher Ami, made it out, although they were badly hurt. They arrived back at the headquarters some 25 minutes later, having covered 25 miles with this message from the battalion. We're along the road parallel to 276.4. Our own artillery is dropping a barrage directly on us. For heaven's sake, stop it. Cher Ami delivered this message despite sustaining a bullet wound through the breast blindness in one eye and one of the legs hanging on by a tendon. Without that pigeon, the lives of just under 200 soldiers would have been lost in the Battle of the Argonne. Whether DICE took some inspiration from this story or not, it is a very striking story and showcases just how important the messenger pigeons were in World War I. So there you are, the War Pigeon game mode coming to Battlefield 1 and it has some proper historical relevance as well. 
Let me know what you think of the game mode down below in the comments. But until next time, my name is Westy, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.